Hey, what's up? This is Gizmo. Today we're going to be showing you guys the iPhone 5S. This is AT&T 64 gigabyte version. As you can see here, I just got it out of the box. I was in line since 5.30 this morning since you couldn't pre-order it. Um, we're going to show you what's inside here. So we're going to move this aside for right now and just show you guys basically the box. We have the fingerprint sensor. Cool little box here and all that good stuff. Open this up. You get the instructions. Uh, nice new ear pods new thing here, the lightning adapter cable to USB, which will plug right into there, everything's neatly, nicely tucked away. Um, these are all pretty much the same as what they've been making them, so that will, I'm not going to open that up right now. Put this back together, show you guys the actual hardware of the phone. Now this is the actual physical phone that just came out today, and you can see here we have the space gray version, um, it's really nice and clean. You can see here, it's just nice and black and it's got almost like that graphite gray color. It's not silver, it's definitely a blackish dark gray. Um, they call it space gray. Here's the new camera sensor with the dual LED flash. We have a microphone on the back. It helps pick up sound and eliminate noise. And uh, you can see here's the Apple logo right here, shiny. Kind of has a little gradient rough uh, grain effect to it. It's not all smooth and clean. Um, gives it a cool metal metallic look. Um, move down towards the phone on the bottom. You can see here we have the basic information that we all come to know. The bottom of the phone is just like the iPhone 5. Uh, you can see with the speaker, microphone, your little headphone jack is now move on, on the bottom since the iPhone 5 and we have the lightning port here. We have the touch ID sensor right here. You can see it little metallic ring goes around looks really nice now with the fingerprint sensor all you really have to do is either turn the screen on or press here once and then lay your finger on top and it logs you right in it takes a really quick second everything is really uh, easy at the corners of the phone here you can see it's just a nice metallic it's not that silver uh, that was before that the iPhones had phone feels really great in your hands it's very light it's comfortable LED flash here works good with the case as well. Um, if you hear that noise in the background, it is a stupid landscape or people coming. Um, yeah, so this is pretty much a quick hands-on showing you guys what it feels like, what it looks like in your hands. Uh, everything else remains the same. You have the smooth bevel over here where it's just a nice round uh, curve. And then again, the headphones on the bottom. Um, that's iOS 7 on the new iPhone 5S 64GB and uh, it's pretty cool. Um, the 64-bit, the, the RAM, everything is super duper fast. I'm downloading apps right now and um, it's just a really cool thing to see. Uh, we have the camera which does really awesome slow motion video. This Now I'm going to film him, he's just going to move normal and then we're going to make him move real fast and look around and then stop. Now we're frame, filming at 120 frames per second. We'll go back to our main screen here and you'll see a chunk of it is already selected and you'll see it go in slow motion. So here's a quick look at another slow motion video we just did really quickly. Just show you guys what it's like. You even get sound in slow motion which is pretty cool. Now we have Cookie Monster as our volunteer and we have this burst mode. We're going to show you guys what it looks like exactly. Um, we're just going to press and hold and then you'll see it take a bunch of pictures. We're going to go back here to our main camera mode in our camera roll. You see it took 38 pictures. We're going to see favorites and see what it picked out. You can see a bunch of them are all blurry of him moving around. Let's see if we can find a good shot of him in here. Got one decent picture. This one's pretty good. So we're gonna go ahead and pick that one. Go look around here. This one's pretty good. And let's see here. That one looks great. Put that and then we're gonna hit done. Now we're in our burst mode picture. We're gonna go here and tap delete. And it says it's gonna delete 16 pictures. So we wanna make sure we delete them and only use our favorite pictures that we selected. So we have that one, that one, 
that one. And I've saved our photos. This is the first burst mode that we did. We need to get rid of those 35. We're going to show you guys what the iPhone 4S looks like with just a normal flash. Um, you can see I have it on here. I'm just going to take the picture and flash. Now this has just one LED flash. And now we're going to check out the iPhone 5S flash with the dual LED flash. I'm going to turn it on. Make sure we're focused on him. Take a picture. Uh, you can see that it, it used the one flash to kind of get a focus and get a natural tone. While we have the other one that gives a much more white tone. It might be hard to see on the camera, but you can see on the iPhone 4S it looks a little more natural and not so blown out white. Um, as you can see, Mickey's hair is really like blown out white, while here his skin still looks intact and normal. But again, this is on your the camera might look a little different. Um, and yeah, so there's that. It's a photo comparison. And uh, front camera is 1.2 megapixel. It's a lot better than before. We're going to test out a game loading, so we're just going to tap on here and see which one loads first. See the 5S loads quicker. We're already starting the game. We're playing for a long time as that was just taking forever to load. Rovio here. Angry Bird Space. Welcome back. Loading. So we're gonna go here. You can see it's still loading. Already into the game. This is just starting up. Already into the game. One's running a lot more powerful OS, and you can see this is still downloading stuff. So that's a quick look at iOS 7 on iPhone 5S and the iPhone 5S hardware. Um, really great. It's very light in your hands compared to this one. Um, fingerprint sensor was really cool. You just tap, hold, and you're in right away. You see how quick that was. Boom. It's almost as easy as a swipe. You could also swipe over if you want. You don't always have to use the fingerprint. You just swipe over, put your password in, and you're done. Hold your finger on there. Boom. So yeah, it's a quick look. Make sure you guys subscribe to our videos. We've got a ton of gadget videos and app reviews. Um, check out the iPhone 5S if you can't get it. Pre -order, or order it in stores online. And have fun. Let us know what you guys think of the new phone.